What's up, what's happening, what is going on, cantaloupes? When you think about fights in sports, I guess when you think about baseball, you think about the old battles between the Red Sox and the Yankees, Don Zimmer getting thrown by Pedro Martinez. In hockey, you think about, well, every single game, uh, the NBA, you think about the malice in the palace, and the NFL, well, they have helmets on. So it's not every day you get to see punching and fighting, but they're there. I'm Mike Cantalupo, and today we present the 10 craziest NFL fights. And a huge shout out to Junior Gomez26 for suggesting this video. Oh, and I almost forgot, if you missed Daquan Young, or if you like NFL fights, or fighting in general, subscribe to the main eventer. It is our new WWE channel. It's all about fighting, uh, links, Links in, in the description. We'll tag a comment, pin a comment, whatever it's called. Let's go watch the video. Patriots Bills pregame scuffle. Week four of the 2016 season, the Bills tried rattling Jacoby Brissett before the contest, and that didn't work out too well. On the Buffalo Bills warming up right there. Oh my word. Come on. He just really shoved Jacoby Brissett for, I guess he's on that other side of 50. Is that what, are you allowed to do that? Kurt, what do you think? Man, I guess he's Brissett running on, on their Come side on, of the field. Man. This was moments ago. Now imagine the uproar if they did that on Tom Brady. Lions and Bears, oh my, 2011 game between the Lions and the Bears. Matt Stafford throws a pick. He was getting blocked on the return and he was not happy about it. Pick every 15 throws. He only has one guy to really throw the football to and that's Calvin Johnson. Now you just don't want to throw the ball 63 times in a game against the Bears. Stafford, four interceptions. Oh, geez. Oh. On the hey, day. Hey, 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 Let hey. me see this 10-20. Watch the Matthew Stafford. Right there. Pulls his head Matthew off. See, that, yeah. Now, quarterback should be fine, now, right? Uh, well, yep, right. Matthew Stafford. And now he gets guy. rushed. He started that. He gets rushed. You know what? We're going to find yeah. out. And Leave Sproles alone. 2016 game between the Redskins and the Eagles. Darren Sproles is kind of small compared to the rest of the league. That's an understatement, but he got popped on this punt return. The Eagles stuck up for their teammate. Good kick. Sproles up. Oh, he gets blasted. The ball is loose, and there's a flag. To Shazer Everett, and now there's a scrum breaking loose. And it's ugly. That was a high, hard shot on Sproles. And the Eagles standing up for their teammate. Tlaib versus Crabtree. Now this is a long withstanding rivalry. They met again in a 2017 game, both among the NFL's biggest hotheads, insert fighting. Around his ankles. Oh, we have a fight on the other side. Look at this, after Crabtree. Helmets being thrown, Tlaib grabbed it off. Referee is down and look at holding on to his ribs. Well, that started with the block. That was Crabtree on a keep to leap. Remember, there's some history between these two guys, and I think that's really where the fight started. Crabtree actually blocks him. Off Look, the we, field. Got, we have another one right Look here. Look at this. Oh, and a swing right well, there. This is crazy because now you're going to get injected from the game. I mean, this is just selfish. When, when your own self-interest are more important than the team, then you put yourself and your team at risk. Each were given two game suspensions for this. They ended up being reduced to one. Akeem Tlaib and Steve Smith. Welcome back, Akeem. Panthers, Patriots, Monday Night Football. Akeem Tlaib in the center. Steve Smith is not one to put up with any shenanigans. Five, he throws high. What a grab by Smith. First down Carolina at the 34 as he and Tlaib get started and go at it. And company comes to see what's going on. I'm surprised it took this long. He's got a plus split outside stem. He breaks back to the inside and good call by the official. The one on one coverage for Steve Smith who's trying to run his high breaking route. He does an excellent job using his hands. Saints versus the Buccaneers. The Saints were blowing out the Bucks in a 2017 game. Ryan Fitzpatrick was hit low and late. Marshawn Lattimore confronted the Bucks players, started a major brawl. 
between the two teams. My beverage, a huge fight just broke out between the Saints and the Buccaneers. So Ryan Fitzpatrick gets hit late. This happens on the sideline after that play. You're wondering what happened. Okay, we're going to show you the slow-mo replay here. Remember, Jameis Winston is injured on the sideline. Winston points in the back of Marcus Lattimore's neck. Lattimore pushes him. Mike Evans comes flying out of the top rope and lays out Lattimore. And then we got a fight on the sideline of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Andre Johnson versus Cortland Finnegan. This one's an all-time classic. Texans Titans 2010 game. I mean, just watch. Touchdown 14 or nothing. And then Andre Johnson and Cortland Finnegan going at each other. This is something else. Watch this, folks. Now you talk about a fight, this is serious stuff. This is Jimmy on your left, and that's Howie on the right. And that's how we warm up for the pregame show. But our guys- Corlin Finnegan says Andre Johnson hits like a bish. When did he say that? His retirement conference. AJ Green versus Jalen Ramsey. Bengals, Jags, AJ Green, Jalen Ramsey were on each other throughout the game. And then AJ Green delivered a cheap shot, which got a fight out of control. A huge fight and everybody goes at it. Now you see the players running into it. That's AJ Green and Jalen Ramsey at the bottom of the pile. AJ Green throwing several punches and I'm going to show you a replay in a moment that he tried to choke hold on Jalen Ramsey. Watch. So Ramsey will push him down. Ramsey pushed down AJ Green. Green throws him in a choke hold, rips him back down and is throwing punches. No one has any chill at this moment. And they're after it. Odell and Josh Norman, Giants, Panthers, week 15, 2015. Beckham said that Norman threatened him with a baseball bat. So that got all of this started. Be a drive where the Giants are thinking about what could have been. And here's what was going on after that run. Well, Josh Norman was on him. They gave a little bit of help. And like Odell Beckham came back in and, and took a shot on Josh Norman even after the last play. These two, wow, these two are still going at it. Well, the last two times we see there from Odell, Odell Beckham. Well, it's a, it, this is embarrassing. It's embarrassing for Odell Beckham. It's embarrassing oh. for the Giants. There's a shot. I mean, Josh Norman has owned him in this game, and when he hasn't been on him, someone else has. They haven't. The Super Brawl. We all know Malcolm Butler's interception to seal the game. But did you know the Seahawks took an offsides penalty in the end of the game, which led to a fight being broken out? Solid Al, Tyree, Mario Manningham, fluky plays. This time, after all the stuff of these two weeks. And then a scrum, of course, here you go, flags. Uh, so you'll have an ugly ending to what was a pretty terrific ball game. Well, a lot of frustration out there. And, and the guys in blue. You know, yeah. from Seattle standpoint. What do you think is the craziest NFL fight ever? Let me know in the comments below. Until next time, I am Mike Canalupo. Thanks for watching.